Many years ago, I was standing on one of my balconies when a taxi driver was obnoxiously blowing his horn out front and yelling for a blind man to walk toward my voice from his own townhouse. That direction was toward traffic. My roommate and I went down and helped him to the taxi and scolded the driver for being so rude. I made the mistake of giving the blind neighbor my phone number so that I could give him a ride in the future. Then the phone calls came and never stopped. And when I gave him a ride, he would ask for various detours. I'm very calculated. If he had told me beforehand where he wanted to go, it would be cool, but no, we'd be driving along, and he'd throw in two three extra places on each ride. And it came to be every day that he wanted rides, and he'd even call me to remind me to give him a ride, not that was ever later backed out. Finally I had enough. So I gauged how blind he was. His response was that he was blind as a bat. A week or two after he said that, I told him I had a job interview in the next city. A week after that, I told him I got the job and was moving away in a month. After I moved away it was strange as hell walking by him in silence as he stood on the sidewalk. Ben can smell you and me. I think it is important to take this post as an opportunity to reflect on how you can set boundaries in the future there will be other metaphorical. Blind guys needing rides in the future. Thankfully he moved in with his brother about a year later. The sound of your car the pattern of your steps I bet him you know. I hope you don't see this post. Be sure wasn't he seeing anybody. Plot twist he's dead ever back in the days. So when he was a jerk calling his neighbor every day like he didn't see her. His own life that ass how he get ghosted. Thanks mom. Oh has blind not stupid, you definitely need stayed around more. Hey screen time is over go to bed. He probably knew. He was probably lonely. This kinda makes me sad because I can also know which one of my family members is walking in just by the sound of the door being unlocked. It's a simple joke, but I'm a simple guy. This guy sounds like an asshole you can be blind and an asshole he was. Taking advantage of you. Hot to stop getting to legal trouble and needs a cheap lawyer. The blind guys were the friends we wish we hadn't he made along the way. Well imagine if he stopped suddenly and said oh Pican S M E L L Y O U. The office at home too close I could always tell he was walking toward. My room and opening the door as a teenager thanks for the privacy. I relation from his mom. This would make a great episode of Curb Your Enthusiasm. You know how you stay lonely becoming an unwelcome. Burden and taking advantage of others' kindness. Better call Saul. The bad up as old neighbor sure doesn't he. Plot twist he isn't blind but is going along with your lie. To save face on his lie. Please you mommy give five more mins. I see what you did there. Coming from a blind guy that guy deserved a guitar. In the same, but my bedroom is also right next to the toilet so I've also become attuned to what everyone sounds like when they pee I've always thought this is kind of fed up honestly. Oh just fuck off mate I have compassion and empathy darn t show it all at once. Ever seen see no evil here no evil with Richard Pryor and Gene Wilder one is Deaf and one is blind and they are framed for a crime they witness Together hilarious LMFAO bro this is so fucking funny People are mortified by confrontation with handicapped people My mom was never this perceptive or polite why I got some smart nice moms 
That won't he be fun, let us say he is a deaf mute, and imagine how. They communicate with each other. No quit jacking off all the time. Well now who deaf fucking knew? These days of course I don't give a shit about anything anymore but I... Was younger then I relate to this a lot. Is his brother blind too? Why not just block him on your main account? Easy to empathize when you read not the one bearing the brunt of their assholes. Was he or wasn't he? He a willing fuzzy wuzzy was a woman. Objection! Except switch handicapped with nothing some people are mortified by. Confrontation not sure why though. If I knew I probably wouldn't TB. I was thinking this is totally George minus the helping out in the first place part. Or maybe Hess working up to the longest punchline ever and was waiting for someone to. Called him out day 435. I told Op I wanted to drop by the zoo today I can. Smell how they look like I said. You just played all your hands and now you have no other ways to hide your pee. Identity because your family has had it all. Kids and teens are humans too. If they have no sense of free will it hurts. The long term giving them no privacy at all is part of that. Straight up the dog from up I can smell it or YouTube. Or DQW4W9WGXCQ. Lois, so you created a new account just to avoid the creep. Why make such a hassle when you could be just told him that this is too? Much for you and you don't you want to do it anymore. Hell, I'm not blind and I can tell Will's coming down based on how. They walk on the stairs basic pattern recognition. It was the cardio rule of life whenever you were waiting for something at an indeterminate time it all happen when you start touching yourself, but only if you re actually starting to get into it. I don't think you have anything to feel bad about regardless of his disability the guy was still taking advantage of you. I don't even know what you were looking for, but it is a little to the left. He probably could ask another neighbor, or mention him in the convo and... It'd be a dead giveaway that he lied, he probably knew already so. Isn't he it kind the cool superpower, the like it is awful, but it was kind nice being able to... Track anybody in my house, based on how loud they're... Stops were. Fuck you mom I am staying up dad left you cause you're a whore. Yuri's not my real fucking dad. Screw me there. I heard you was so interesting the crew rises to the top and... The fuck's fall to the bottom. So that's not gonna save you from an ass whooping. Lil' up being blind doesn't make you dumb. He knew you were still fair blind people learn to. Rely on their other senses in ways you wouldn't think possible. Likely ask someone about the new neighbor. This actually makes sense the most. It's time to stop pretending to play on the phone and close. Your eyes are well at least lay down. Preach about empathy and compassion, and then immediately be like learn some. Well read it to a stranger who didn't say nothing to you. Yeah, you do indeed need to F off. Well shit we were all lonely, but we joined discourse and... Post comments on Reddit to fool ourselves into thinking. We have friends not been loads of really time consuming lifts off of our neighbors. That is quite funny, but you can block people on Facebook lol. Especially if it is some random who sent you a friend request. My mom's husband's name actually is Jerry Unfow. Cause your BF be loud as fuck wise Bigfoot stomping up the Stairs more like big dummy. Doesn't he give him a pass to be an ass? Calling up Ock to dictate to him. And judge their mood or what they were up to. They didn't tease since they left out modest. 
there's a very similar episode, where a blind guy has Larry and Richard. Moving his furniture around. That's blind not amputated. It isn't he, but it is an invasion of privacy. You know what else is it nice being an inconsiderate asshole lad? Wasting your neighbor's time constantly regardless of your disability. I knew it s hard to fix a problem when you don't know it s. A problem presumably op never mentioned that he didn't t. Want to drive him more that he didn't t want to take detours. Hence not really fucking your dad, though or whatever it was. Now I can tell exactly which family member is coming towards my room. When you get no privacy, you learn to make privacy. Objection! It's not being an asshole dude op didn't he even bother trying to communicate. But the dude before dumping his ass, not everyone is lucky enough to. Be socially aware of stuff like this. I should have put my lips in spam at the start and have a disclaimer. For people to scroll down to the bottom. Objection! The desk screen reader's all the way down. You read the reason the girl on the Martin Soul carton has an umbrella. You read so obnoxious it feels like you're training. I am creeping around right now you just can see see me as I. Have evolved invisibility although I have. The measly shivet is quite effective when applied to the jugular. I wish I could do that to a lot of people in my life, but... They're empty blind. Yep, everyone walks uniquely. Man, some people just don't to understand the complexity of life they absolutely were. Hey, it s or right, you were just the type of person who TV used like op it s okay being nice, but there is a... Reason people like me and got nerd up there and t. I feel a little bad for chuckling. This reminds of just how much people infantilize people with disabilities like we're still humans and now we can be assholes just like anyone else haha. That's can see he told you the truth. I don't even know how true this is, but I love it. Now that's amazing, should have just said that you got a DUI had never. Want to write again even if you knew you drove again well. His neighbor is really a German Shepherd. Hot woo, but always being nice is not the same thing especially to condescending wankers. Sometimes I deeply miss being younger, but then I remember how many fucks I gave about Tiny. Insignificant nonsense and I am not so sure I'd like it if I could go back somehow. I'll literally said they would run into each other. I bet he never saw that coming. He can smell you walking by. Posts on this sub event meant to be funny the op feels bad. About what he did. He fucked it up for himself. Ick yow right has not my dad fucked Jerry. Our brand sentence. In blind Michael in not stuffed up. George literally is in curb your enthusiasm and I am not talking about Jason Alexander. You read the comment then. Lay that bitch deserved it man give them an inch, and they take a mile people. Like that makes me not want to help anyone ever. Be a bitch you hate and teeth out of the snow. I never said or implied that in fact I said the opposite if you had scrolled. Half a centimeter you would have seen where I said. But that doesn't he justify it. You don't say. Jimmy has something to do with how your parents handled conflict. Objection! Like normal people by yelling at each other until. They got tired of seeing each other as face. I don't even know how I'd even walk back an offer like that I'd probably. Start making plans, so that I was unavailable most days. I think they should have just told them it became too much, but I wouldn't say it's cold they tried to help someone. 
I could tell this is even in scenarios that didn't involve any sort of privacy. It's just learning based on sounds you hear repetitively. He delicately walks up the stairs a journey upstairs is a race against. But we pass cell sound is no object get fucking stumping. As a fellow blind person if he spent enough time around him. He absolutely knew. The t-shirt does have a strong odor. They were and I was being an asshole because they were. Is this George Costanza? That last sentence I really needed that laugh dude. He can definitely smell you. But that's the most sensitive part of your body when you really have in the rank your ears. Those give him the right to free rides whenever he demands. I love you. We'll definitely do the same he just used you don't feel bad. Sometimes those people can be asses too. People with disabilities are not exempted from being assholes. He probably knew the sound of your footsteps. This is radical IMO. Or you could just say dude I am not a taxi service. At some point he is gonna know he will hear your voice and he will know so. Better set the record straight dude. You don't have parents or you will clone no weight robot. I can tell who walks into my house by the sound of their breathing the walking. The noise they make at least for my grown children and husband. This was the comment I was looking for. One time I told a man with one eye to keep. His eye on his phone data. <laughs>